Well, good morning everybody. So I'm in my car today. Um, I woke up this morning and the word obedience came to me. And it brought me back to a time where I was 13 years old. And I had a friend and she lived in Ipswich. I lived in Cambridge. And she was saved because I witnessed to her. She got baptised and she, we were just full of it at 13. We were just on fire for the Lord. One six weeks holiday, I decided to go and spend a couple of weeks with her in Ipswich. And what we did one day, she said to me, let's go and see some friends of mine. They used to live in Cambridge. I said, OK, so we went to the house and there was a group of young adults there maybe between the ages of, I don't know, 13 up to the age of about 19 or 20, quite a few of them, maybe about five or six, perhaps more. And we went there and um, I recognised them. Anyway, we got chatting and me and my friend, we delivered the word of God to them. We preached the gospel to that group of people. And do you know, they actually accepted the Lord that day in their house. And so what I did was when I went back to Cambridge, told my pastor, and we decided to go and visit them each week, a group of us from Cambridge. We had missionaries come, we had prayer meetings, I bought my guitar, we'd sing, we'd pray with them, and two of them actually became leaders of a church that we planted in Ipswich, all because of obedience. I followed the leading of the Lord and I thank God because many souls have been saved through that church and that church is still going strong today. I want to encourage you, be obedient to the Lord. Remember, it was disobedience that got this world in the mess it's in today. Just listen to the voice of the Lord, follow his leading, you can't go wrong. Have a good day.